two of my favorite people. Yeah. These, these people are great creative artists, and they're emerging fashion and chess. Susan Sherman, the chairman of the board, and Eric Johnson, the executive director, welcome to the show. Thank you, Thank you Maurice. Maurice. Last time we sat here, it was only an inception, a uh, conception at its inception. <laughs> uh, the, the idea of bridging chess and fashion is something a lot of people may not be comfortable with, but you guys have been working really hard, and since then, a lot has happened. Tell us, first of all, what the chess design uh, challenge, fashion design challenge is. So as we said last time, it feels like it was just yesterday we were here, um, we were pairing six of our incubator designers with six chess grandmasters, including yourself, to come up with a chess uniform. And they've been working since January on their sketches, which we unveiled at the opening of the championships, you know, the other night. And they'll continue to work with the grandmasters in a really solid partnership going back and forth until they unveil their prototypes in August at a big event here in St. Louis. And then the winner will receive $10,000, a $10,000 scholarship. It's going to be tough. I mean, they're working really hard on this and taking it very seriously. I know. I was with mine uh, yesterday, Audra Noz. And uh, we're going to win. Yeah, yeah. yeah. well, I have no doubt. We, we just, we, we're just going to win. The rest, can, they can keep trying. Yeah. That's right. How's it been going, Eric, uh, at uh, the Fashion Fund? I was down there yesterday, and I saw you That's regaling right. a, a bunch of ladies with your wit. and uh, They were just <laughs> laughing it up. Well, well, I didn't even know what you were saying, but yeah. the, the laughter was so loud, you were distracting us. Well, every day is um, an exciting day at the St. Louis Fashion Incubator, and we've been open now since January 9th. We have all of our six designers in place. We're also really working with the community to bring them into our space, uh, not only to show them what we're doing, but to you know offer the uh, fashion and designer community here in St. Louis tools to help their businesses grow. Um, so you know, uh, again, I, I uh, would say that it was a fun event. We had um, the women's club uh, down to our space to uh, be with our designers and to understand the incubator, and it's just you know uh, a fabulous way that you know we're getting the word out about the work that we're doing. Susan, tell us, what do you see as the net effect of something like this to bridge chess and fashion together for both fields? Well, I mean, chess, what you all have done here, I mean, making St. Louis the chess capital, I said of the United States and that you're opening, they said of the world, sure has the been world, yeah. nothing short of miraculous. And, you know, we think that in fashion we can kind of learn from you. I mean, you, you built this chess campus. We're trying to rebuild a garment district, and you did it in a couple of years and we're trying to do the same and I think for us it's really job creation and economic development so yes we have these designers and we're accelerating their businesses but long term we're looking to bring back creatives into the garment district and really start some small batch production there and um, kind of bring an industry back I guess you've brought an industry yeah. here we're trying to bring one back but Eric you're coming out of New York I know and now you're in St. Louis what is it like uh, how exciting is it to be at the forefront of something like this the the renaissance once again of fashion yeah. here in St. Louis. Yeah, I mean, I think it was really, as, as I described it to, uh, to Susan as I was interviewing for this position, it was really a once in a lifetime experience. And, um, you know, I think that especially coming from New York where, you know, uh, there's so much going on, to come to St. Louis where we have this rich tradition in this case of chess and to be able to merge these worlds and to create something that together is so much bigger than any of us could do on our own is just such a great um, experience for our organization and hopefully it's uh, one for the World Chess Hall of Fame as well. Well, I'm very excited about it. Like I said, uh, we're going to win. No, <laughs> no, 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 I got Emily Colbert. Wait, Jennifer has a good chance, <laughs> too. Jennifer has Thank a good chance, whatever. And talk about style. That woman doesn't need a chess uniform. Yeah, right? that, that is the truth. That is the truth. But, Jen, I'm sorry. You know, we're competitive. Yeah. <laughs> and uh, we, we're looking. We've we got some interesting designs right. coming. I'm sure they do too, but we're keeping ours in right. secret. Okay, right. cool. Can't well, wait. Thank you so much for joining us. Yeah. It's an absolute pleasure thank to you. be a part of this project. Susan Sherman and Eric Johnson doing their thing for fashion and chess. It'll be an exciting summer as August comes and we unveil all these spectacular designs.